Mmm. All right, we're getting some people on. Just enjoying a coffee, sitting in a parking lot. Hello, hello, Casper. Hello, Kyle. J. Cole. And Solo. Copy. And Bob. Hello. Amberlyn. Patrick's. Danny. All right, so I just picked up a Tim Hortons Double Double which is two sugar, two cream, large size. Because that's the way you gotta go. Large or home, right? Sup, we've got lots of people happening. I'm got 70 people. So my little question to you guys is how you like your coffee. We got Windsor, Ontario in the house. We got Caesar. Oh. Mmm. I had my own Tim Hortons. Pavel likes double double. Coffee in the afternoon is the best. It is, isn't it? It's like a nice little snack. Special treats. Uh, have you ever heard of a four by four? It's four sugar and four cream. That's crazy. We got Sweden in the house. And what is your favorite donut? This is one of my favorite donuts. This is the chocolate uh, glazed donut or the chocolate dip donut. And let's let's see how fresh it is. Oh, it's fresh. I can squeeze it and it's sinking in. Mmm. Check that out. No, that's a good donut. What's your uh what is your favorite donut, guys? Whether it's at Tim Hortons uh, or whatever, uh, Dunkin' Donuts. Mm. Just blocking out the jerks that come on, that have nothing better to do than to come on and, and harass people. But it's so easy to delete them. So, thanks Periscope. I need a coffee and a donut now, Ken. Krispy Kreme. I've been thinking about going over to Krispy Kreme and doing the uh, 12, uh, 12 dozen. <laughs> the 12 donut challenge. Uh, Furious Pete did it. I think he did it in like, I think it was a minute. Or just under a minute. Can't remember. Milo milk for sugar. I'm not sure what Milo is. I heard of Milo and Otis. Bear claw, gotta have it. Or an apple fritter. I like. I really liked it when they had the blueberry fritters here at, at uh, Tim Hortons. Andy is saying, "Where are you going, Kim?" Um, I'm not going anywhere. I am uh, up in Barrie, Ontario. I uh, had to drop Megan off at the doctor's and dropped Ben off at Mountain Equipment Co-op. He wants to buy himself a new backpack. And right outside Megan's doctor's is the uh, the Tim Hortons. And I'm eating some donut. Mmm. Let's see. We have 93 people, 96 people. What donut do you think is Megan's favorite donut? Any guesses? Anyone? Sprinkles, plain, Boston cream, Reese, glazed. It's glazed, but what? Uh, Nutella, honey dip, Reese, Boston cream, jelly filled. You're missing one specific, no, not chocolate. Uh, not blueberry. Somebody's got to say it. Oh boy. Uh, so nobody's got it. Ooh. Okay, nobody guessed it. So we're gonna go just open it up and show you. She likes the cinnamon glazed donut, which is definitely one of my favorites as well. Now, 
some of you already guessed uh, one of the donuts that I bought for Ben. What? Mmm. Uh, yeah, Megan's okay. It's just a regular checkup thing. Some people hate cinnamon. Yeah, don't worry, guys. Uh, as as the, the the dumb comments come through, I just hit block, and uh, we will not see their comments again. Unless they start up another uh, Periscope. So, And so what do you think? You guys probably already... You guys already guessed what other donut I bought, but I didn't say it was for Megan in specific. So this was this is the Reese donut, and I did a review on it. I bought this one for Ben. I don't think he's tried it yet. So there's Reese peanut butter cups on top, peanuts, uh, the chocolate fondant. Uh, Megan is my daughter for the person who is asking, who is Megan? Ben is my son. Megan's uh, a very private person and doesn't really like uh, being in videos. Although she said the other day, yeah, Megan is nine, uh, is 18. Do I get paid for Periscope? No, but it's just a great way of getting together with you guys and answering your questions. So, uh, like I said, I'm just up here. She's just going to a, just a regular checkup kind of thing. And, uh, yeah having a coffee. Uh, Periscope's like a live a live show on YouTube without YouTube. Uh, I've been debating on whether or not to start. Yeah, Megan is a vegetarian, not a vegan. Um, uh, what flavor is the coffee? It's just the regular uh, Tim Hortons Double Double. So I put two sugar, two cream. Why are you in the... Why are you... The driver for everyone, haha. Uh, Megan's not too uh, familiar with a standard shift, uh, standard car. Uh, so this is a six-speed uh, manual. Uh, Carol's gone camping, so Megan. So Carol has the automatic car, which is the the CRV Honda, and uh, Ben can't drive yet. Patrick's. Mr. Wolf says, really want to see her. She, you know what Megan said to me yesterday? She said, I'll be in a video if you do uh, basically the challenge of eating a whole um, Dairy Queen cake with her. That's what, that's, she, that's the, if we bought that and then as a reward of being in a video, finally, that she gets her own cake. She just loves the, the uh, um, Dairy Queen ice cream cakes. Have a review coming up. Yes, tomorrow is the release of the video, the two videos that we did uh, with the Crude Brothers. We did the uh, Fat Bastard Burrito for their channel, and we did the Carl's Jr. Jalapeno Poppers for my channel. So they'll be up tomorrow at 3 o'clock. Can you do the new Mighty Angus from McDonald's? I'll see if I have time. Oh, great. How did you and Carol meet? We met uh, uh, at a bar. Uh, there was a bar close to our house, and that was just where everybody went on a Thursday, Friday, and Saturday night. And eventually, uh, we started talking. I was wearing a shirt that I had uh, painted. Uh, I was really into Roger Rabbit and uh, Disney, still am. And so I painted my own Roger Rabbit shirt. And uh, Carol's like, oh, I like your shirt. And the rest is history. Uh, how did, how, or do review with Megan? Yeah, she wants to do the, the ice cream cake at, at uh, Dairy Queen. But we'll see. She might chicken out. She actually was possibly going to be introduced to you guys when I did the ghost pepper challenge for my 100,000 subscriber. So she was there, but then didn't want to be in it at the last second. Uh, Ken, you old smoothie. Yes. Megan going to collab? Maybe. Or college. Oh, okay. College is the word. Uh, she's doing a victory lap. Did you, guys, did you guys not know that I did the McWhopper Mac? It was me, Natter from Freak Eating, and Damon Devours from Spray Mucus. All three of us did a collab together, and we created the McWhopper Mac and we did it like, I don't know, a year ago or more. 
And a lot of you guys have seen it. A lot of people are like emailing me saying, hey, Ken, have you seen this McWhopper Mac? And I'm like, I did it. And they're like, what? So they, they're, I, I'm pretty sure that uh, Burger King stole the idea from me. But what are you going to do? What's the vid name? What vid? Sarah says, LOL, can you need to play something? I don't know what that was. Call them. Yeah, hi, Burger King. Yeah, you stole my idea. Thanks. What's it called? Don't have a clue what you're talking about. Review the new Lay's contest flavors. I might be able to get around to doing that. Love the McWhopper Mac video you did. Made me hungry. Yeah, it was a three-way uh, collab with, uh, again, Freak Eating, Natter, Rada, and uh, Damon Devours. Does YouTube pay good? Only if you get lots of views. You need lots of views. And subscribers definitely help with that. Uh, but you don't get paid by subscribers. A lot of people think you get paid by how many subscribers you have. But we know channels that have over a million subscribers. Yet when they post a video, they only get maybe 50,000 views. So how does that work? So you need... I'd, I'd rather have 100,000 subscribers and get 100,000 views off a very strong subscriber base uh, than have a million subscribers and not get the views because then you can't get uh, the money. You from Kentucky, Ken? No, I am from Canada. What's your take on the new YouTube gaming? Uh, I saw a video on it yesterday, but they just showed it. They didn't show how you could work it and it wasn't a, a nice tutorial instructional video. It wasn't anything like that. So I need a, a nice tutorial uh, how to use it, why you'd want to use it. Uh, no good re good reviews from Joey's World Tour. I think Joey's doing good reviews. Uh, uh, advice for somebody wanting to start YouTube. Uh, do something you really like and never quit. Do not stop posting videos. As soon as you stop posting videos, your subscriber base leaves and you're done. When did you go bald? Uh, I actually started losing my hair when I was 17. Uh, where, where are you, Ken? Show us, please. Okay. Um, I'm just up in Barrie, Ontario. Uh, every time I watch your videos at night, it makes me insanely hungry. Anne Berlin is not happy. I don't know why. Uh, how is the censorship from along? Uh, why did you? Why did not you show? I don't understand the phrasing of some of these comments. Uh, favorite type of music? Uh, be reggae. I do like. 80s type of music. I like rock and roll. I love uh, uh, what's that called? Like Skrillex type stuff. Ben got me introduced to that. The Heisenberg hat is hanging in my back hallway. I don't wear it around too often. Do you smoke? No, I do not smoke. Uh, he loves Hawaiian music. I do love Hawaiian music. It makes me feel like I'm not in cold Canada sometimes. Dubstep, that's what it's called, yeah. Uh, more bike rides, definitely. What's Tim Hortons? Tim Hortons is a coffee shop, donut store, sandwich shop now. Canada versus States. How is the sponsorship coming along? Uh, not, we, I've got people working on it. So we hope we hope we get uh, sponsored by a beverage company, um, or a car company, or clothing, or shaving, or anything to do with what I do, but without being a food sponsorship. We don't need a food sponsorship to sponsor me for six months or a year because that, that was won't work. What was your job before YouTube? I worked for the York Region District School Board as a video producer producing content for educational purposes. I love Canada. I love Canada too. One o'clock in the morning brings me hungry. Ah. 
How do you meet Paul? Paul and I met in grade 12. We both left our previous different schools and then we ended up going to the same semestered school and we just happened to have the same English class. So uh, let me let me show you around because some people want to see what's going on. So I just double tap. So there's the Tim Hortons over there. Sorry for the gray skies. So I'm just sitting in a parking lot up in Barrie and uh, let me go nice and slow. Oh, big truck going by. Got some buildings off to the right. Yeah, there you go. I want to move to Canada. Uh, I'm going to stalk you. Nice. Uh, where else have you traveled within Canada? I've been from, the only province I think I haven't been to is uh, Newfoundland. I've been to every province but Newfoundland. I don't know why my phone is like fading. Why is it fading? It's like getting darker or something. I have not been to Europe whatsoever. Uh, where's your next game con game con meetup? I don't know. It'll probably be in Galveston next year. I'd like to visit Nova Scotia. Yeah, Nova Scotia was great. Uh, where's the best place to live in Canada? We like it cold. Uh, well, it snowed in Calgary uh, about a week or two ago. How's your car holding up? It's holding up well. Maybe my phone's getting hot or something. That's why it's getting dark. I'm doing a really long thing here. Uh, Winnipeg, let's please blow on the camera. Woo, come on camera, cool down. Sarnia is nice city. Uh, snow's early up there, eh? Sometimes. It's auto brightness, but I don't have auto brightness on auto. I, I like to control my own brightness. Uh, any more missing cat sightings? Nope. And I saw the, the lady who owns that cat rider bike by today. How many miles on the Suzuki? Let me turn the car on and find out. I'm curious. 93,000 kilometers, which isn't, but that's actually quite good because we bought the car four years ago. My first periscope. Did you see my message? Sorry, I didn't see a message. Lots of messages go by and anyway. On your rating scale, how would you rate Periscope? It's a 10, man. Or it's a go out and get it now. A 10. How much is that in miles? I don't know. I'm I'm using my phone, so I can't convert it. I think it's like two point something kilometers. So uh, in a mile, so it'd be like 50 to 60,000 miles, maybe. Oh. That's just a wild guess. Why did Megan go to Germany? She was on a, on a German exchange thing is all about learning about global issues and learning out how other people live in the world uh, a mile is 1.6 kilometers for how long do you do review now years uh, I guess a, a year and a half two years Megan sounds smart yes yeah, she is all right guys I gotta go my cup my phone's heating up like crazy uh, this is like the longest periscope I think I've done Anyways, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for all the hearts. And we will talk to you again real soon. Uh, we'll maybe do another live food review tonight. Talk to you later. Bye.